What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today I'm really excited to uh, run this really fun deck. This is the Ramp Moon Feasting deck. We are ramping uh, to both Bad Moon Rising. Really, really fun card. Turns all your little guys into uh, cards that cost five or more. Hopefully you get Zamba. Uh, the other card we're ramping to is Gargantuar's Feast. So one strat we're going to be using is something I've been doing a lot, which is teleporting in Gentleman Zombie. Then it pops, you know, it's protected in its Gravestone. Pops up the next turn and gives you two more brains. So you can do that on turn uh, eight, actually, either with the Teleport or Teleportation Zombie. And then on turn nine, you'll have enough for the Garg Feast. Um, you can also do that on turn four. And then on turn five, you'll have enough for Bad Moon Rising. Now, there's other ways of ramping, too. We are running Nebula, and the cards you can put into Nebula are uh, the Egg. The Egg will uh, gain you an extra brain, and then Hatch gain an extra brain, so if they don't remove the Egg, it actually gives you three extra brains that turn. Anyway, it's a cheap card that's good for Bad Moon Rising. Uh, you can also do a similar thing with Barrel of Dead Beards. I guess you can final mission it for free when it's in Nebula. It kind of gives you that extra value. Uh, we can even just put Gentleman into the Nebula and when it pops out. If they can't answer the environment, then it's giving you a whole bunch of extra brains that turn. Well, let's see how this deck does. Hope you guys enjoy. We will be, again, controlling with Bungie, with Barrel Final Mission, and with Rocket Science. Uh, let's see if we can actually use <laughs> the, uh... Bad Moon Rising and Garg Feast as win conditions in this deck. I'm going to be keeping track of luck score. I'd say let's might as well do a do a bets today. I feel like these games are going to take a long time because, um, you know, the win conditions are Bad Moon Rising and Garg Feast. It's usually the games will take a long time. So let's say we're doing eight games today, and if this deck can win, uh, you know, it's a, it's a meme deck with Garg Feast. Let's say five out of eight is going to be a yes, and four or fewer is going to be no. Uh, so we'll be keeping track of that orally. Not the only thing we're going to be doing orally on the stream. Um, we'll be... We why? Why? Lead. Why do I... I don't know why. Um, so we're going to see five games out of eight is the best. Uh, so five or more is a yes. Uh, four or fewer, so if we break even, is a no. Over here at the live stream, twitch.tv forward slash prima. Five wins out of eight is a yes. Four wins is no. Star protection. All right. We've got to win over 50%. Not a huge ask. I think we can do it, but we'll keep track of luck score anyway. Um. Um. Okay. Well, it's, it's nice to have the final mission so the uh, little backup dancers have something to do. <laughs> they can final mission stuff. Okay, it's happening. Backup Dancers into Bad Moon Rising is real good, so we're just going to keep passing here. Hopefully it doesn't put too much bullseye on the field. Really happy to see him not have a 2 there. Uh, maybe we'll set up Nebula. So how does this work? If we set up Nebula this turn, then the egg will bring us up to 5 next turn, and then to 7. We can't really do the Backup Dancer thing, so I think we're going to wait one more turn on the Nebula here. I'm just going to bungee this for now. It's doing bullseye, so we might as well remove it. We should have Ag Backup Dancers Bad Moon Rising if all else fails. Let's see what happens here. Starch Lord! Mm -mm, mm -mm. I can go for 3 1 2 if one of them lands in the thing. I think we should probably get rid of Starch Lord, right? And we'll have one fewer 5 drop. I mean, we don't have to. I want it, though. Okay, so this way, if we put it here, then the backup dancers, if they don't land in the thing, at least they'll live. Okay, so this is the way. This becomes good either way. And we final mission this one. Love it. Bye, Starch Lord. See ya. Bye-bye. Got him. Uh, so we're ramping a Bad Moon Rising now. Looks good to me. So this will bring us up to uh, actually a little bit overkill, but it's fine. Hopefully it doesn't remove the egg or cover the environment, because that messes us up. Ah, Bloomerang, nice! Survey says active ability would be nice, just because we're transforming it anyhow. Alright, we got an early Bad Moon Rising. 
That was a turn five Bad Moon Rising. Love to see it. Come on, give me something good. Oh my gosh, look at the combos. Guys, the combo, the combo. <laughs> it's really sad, Bad Moon Rising, but at least we got extra value. Hell yeah, Bloomerang dies for free. Love to see it. Love to see it. Uh, what would we want to teleport in? I don't know, man. I'm gonna maybe teleport and see what we get. Maybe I'll barrel somewhere. I don't know what I'm doing here. Doesn't cover our environment, that's fine. Uh -uh. Teleport. Teleport egg? I don't know. <laughs> Let me teleport this one. And we'll take it from there. Play around cube for next turn, why not? Oh my gosh, we got Garg Feast. Should I save this? I don't think so. I think we're just going phase here. We're probably going to get heal comboed really badly here. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, uh, come on. Let's get, uh, let's get Sumo. Sumo, Sumo would be amazing. Come on, Sumo. Come on. Come on. Interdimensional? We can't transform it, though. Too bad the egg didn't hatch after and after the gravestone popped out. It would have transformed. All right, so he gets the heal combo. We just want to roll high so he doesn't heal that much. God damn! Summoning. We'll save that. Summoning. Here comes the geyser. <laughs> this is sad. I think because of the gadget combo, we're adding some luck score. I forgot. Three points of luck. It wasn't super lucky, but it was fine. Uh, the thing we can do is teleport in the gentleman zombie here. And then uh, Garg Feast next turn. That looks like good play. Oh my gosh. No, we're dead! <laughs> Well, we're not going to beat that. <laughs> oh. Seven points of unluck. We're also 0-1 in the score. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, wait. Yeah, there. Keep going. God damn it. I has a Giga Chad beard. Yeah, I gotta trim it. It's pretty good, though. I should be getting a haircut today. Star Lord heal that, guys. That's the new meta. Clearly. I don't know. <sighs> Vodka tastes so good at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. That's water, I promise. Or is it? You guys don't know. Could have anything in that mug, for all you guys know. Um, these are all fine cards. I should probably get rid of the Nebula, though. Hell yeah. So we got card draw. Cory, Minnesota. He's from the motherland. Do you like meme or series decks more? I don't know. I kind of like both. It really depends on my mood. Today I was just in the mood for a meme deck. Oh no. I'm gonna play around Spike Weed Sector. It's, it's way better. If there's a serious deck that just is like this new concept, we've never tried anything like it and just whoops tush, I'd say I like that the best. But mean decks are fun. If I grow a good enough beard, can I be honorary Jewish? And you have to convert, but yeah. Only two small small conditions. No, he's he's hacking. There's no way you got three in a row. Come on, man. You better not play all click bees, I'm gonna be mad. Splash! Whoa. 
We're actually not that far behind here. Okay, he doesn't have another one. He's not cheating anymore. Bonk Choi, ugh. Uh, really would love to top deck another barrel. It would solve a lot of issues here. Huh? Barrel? God damn it. Gosh darn it. Probably final mission, this. Let's go. We we're controlling someone. What are the bets? I'm so curious. The 63% voted yes for the Garg Feast Bad Moon Rising deck. You idiots. <laughs> um, I'd say let's go with the egg. We can final mission it to control here. We're probably just playing for sad Garg Feast. Imagine getting Zombot from Guard Feast anymore. Oh my gosh, what? Whoa, no, 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 no. Okay, let's <laughs> actually trades now. Photosynthesizer, such a good card. Come on, Toxic Waste Imp. Okay. I could teleport and see what happens here. The final mission's kind of sad. I think we need another card for next turn anyway. Is this worth teleporting? It could end up losing the trade, like, I don't know. If it's a 3-2, which there's a lot of 3-cost three 3-2s, three then uh, it loses the trade. This is a lot safer. I'm gonna say save the teleport and take the safe the safe bet. Yeet. Maybe I should have final missioned this one. Oh. oh my gosh. We're just getting so many final missions. We need a I'll burn a teleport, see what we get here. It's turn six, so we still have five more turns. Still stupid. This card needs to cost ten. I don't even know if it would be any good at ten. This card should cost nine. Oh my god, it got burned. It got burned, Nerner. So annoying. Bruh. More like bruh, Nana. Watch him kill this. Uh -huh. We clear his field. Put another one health guy on the field, please. One more bong shot. Okay. <laughs> what is he? Why is he? Oh no! Oh my god! Jesus! Teleport. Ooh, we got gentleman. Gentleman's not active now. It's turn seven. So turn eight. We'll only have ten. This is the play. We he's only got the one card left. We'll probably block and draw or get something here. Uh, these two will trade. We're playing for control. They don't need our dead beard to live. We need his cards not to kill us. Doink! Eureka! Summoning. Garbage. We'll use this as a control card. There's no point in spamming it. Um. So the the gentleman zombie. We can't teleport it in. This is the turn to play it, because if it lives, we get Garg Feast next turn. It's pretty sad. We'll put the egg next to something, too. Yeah, he's out of cards, but he's got a big threat on the field, and the Spike Weed Sector really protects us pretty well here. Okay. I'm guessing we'll get the Garg Feast now, which is awesome. For real. I wonder if I should risk this. This really does go a long way here. We're not going to be able to play it next turn because we're just going to play Garg Feast instead. The chances of this having 3 health is so small, though. I mean, there's almost no chance of it having 3 health. But it's possible. I can't play it in a different lane because it blocks a lane for the Garg Feast next turn. I don't know if this is worth it. I think this really might save it. It saves us from dying to plant food. You just gotta pray for three health. Nope. What else do we get though? Come on, rocket or something. Rocket, rocket, rocket. Oh my god. <laughs> the shark? Okay. Well, that just dies. Uh, it's Bad Moon Rising time. <laughs> Plant food just wins anyway, so we're not playing around him having a bonus attack. No way. 
Okay, come on, Zombot. Come on, Zombot. Let's go. Let's go. We need it. We need the Zombot. This is this is it. This is it. Gentleman's Ram on turn nine. Guard Feast. Come on. Come on. We need something good. We need something good. We need something good. Come on. Come on. Supernova Guard. Defensive end. <laughs> Deep Sea Guard. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know about you. I don't know about you. None of this is actually good, right? He doesn't have cards, so I guess that's the good news. That just dies. Woo! Uh, the soul patch dies, so that's cool. That's what's good about that. Our defensive end just dies in the spike weed sector now. Boom! I think we're fine here. I'm just gonna play shark. Egg. And we can bungee. Bungee's so good, because bungee we can just kill anything. As long as he doesn't get Doom Shroom, we'll be fine. But yeah, we'll, we'll win this game. Easy. I'm gonna bungee this. Come on, Kanga. <laughs> just for funsies. I love how it's Bullseye. Okay, that's fine. So we bungee this. <sighs> love it. Shark lives now. And we're just doing all of this damage now. 8-4 dies for free. We got this game in the bag, though. Guard Feast was good enough. Hell yeah. <laughs> Look how value the shark gets. Really good conjure there from the cosmic scientist. Oh, okay. It's moving. It's fine. Five. This does not hit. Here's seven. So he's gonna, yeah, we just win. There's no. <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm. The summoning really got a ton. That's really a lot of luck. I'm adding 10 points of luck for that game. The guard feast was sad, so I'm also adding two points of unluck. What did he just play? Didn't he top the He There's There's no way he's coming back into this game. There's no there's no way. There's no way he's coming back into this. Gotta get the bullseye damage in. I think you all I wish I was Blockbuster. First of all, first of all, that's just, that top deck, it, it's just 27 points of unluck. I don't care, man. There's a rocket. Oh, I need, a, I need like a bungee. We could win here. Okay, we have the answer to this, luckily. So we'll proc the block. The good news is, the bad news is, he hasn't used his time to shine yet. The good news is he played Rumble. If he gets time to shine now, he wins. Do not, it's a 1 in 3. He's not gonna, after all that, get a 1 in 3 time to shine. We'll probably win this next turn if he doesn't get it here. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 we're fine. Come on, what's in the box? Teleport, okay. Okay. He must have gotten Root Wall. He was BMing? Oh, no, we actually have health left. Teleport. No, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. We need a minion. We need, oh my gosh. We need a miracle! We need a miracle! We need a miracle! We need something! Yes! Yes! Oh! oh yes! Yes! <laughs> the miracle! What I'm talking about! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Why didn't he use the... Oh, he didn't have it. <sighs> that is what I call a freaking game. Come on, man. All right, 27 points of luck. We're all tied up. <laughs> uh, oh, I wonder if that should go in the highlight comp. What do you guys think? I think that's a fail comp, actually.
We need a leap! We need a leap! Let's go. Holy crap, thank you Zombody for two months. <laughs> oh my god. There were a bunch of things that would have won there, but most things from that Bad Moon Rising do not win. No way. No way. <sighs> Holy moly with that. That's too many bungees. I'll keep the teleport though. Alright. Budget grass knuckles, maybe. I'll bunch you then. Don't want the amphibious gatling pee. I think it's just drawing cards. Oh, we're ahead. So we got teleport barrel somewhere. We'll also maybe have teleport uh, gentleman. We could spam our first gentleman here. We can go like gentleman bungee. I like the fact that it it's hard for him to kill a 2-2, honestly. Um, when we have rocket and bungee and all that, and it'll it'll just be giving us extra stuff. What the heck is that? Well that didn't help at all. <laughs> the two for one. Peanut. <laughs> That's stupid. Maybe I'll just stick a barrel in front of that next turn. I don't feel like killing that. Oh, garbage. Oh uh, yeah, so the this total the score for the wins and losses are one and one. It just matters for the bet. I don't care. This is probably going on YouTube no matter what. So we have barrel, condition, we won. I probably should just barrel here. Yeah. I shouldn't have fronted the barrel because we have the final mission. We want to use it later. Whoopsies. Bro, what do they kill us again? Tuna, tuna. <laughs> That's what the Discord guys call it. Love to see it. So we end up with one card. He said, I "I'd rather this go face and the two damage hit us." Uh, so it looks like we're kind of all set up for the ramp, but we have a few more turns here. Hopefully, between Bungie and Rocket, we should be able to control this guy. Bungie. Uh, make it rocket. Pretty good. We're just playing control. So teleporting again, this on eight. It's two more turns. I wonder if we should burn the teleport though. Egg procs the block, unless it's bullseye. Ooh, pot. This isn't such a huge threat, it's just three damage. We'll definitely save our teleport. Not much we can do about it. <laughs> anyway. He's playing around final mission, which is smart. We're really just playing completely for Garg Feast now. Okay. No. Well, it looks like the stream died. Oh, come on. Why? Yeah. 
There, it's back. I don't know what happened here. Uh, I think the video split up, right? Not really sure why that happens. Alright, dude. It's okay. Alright. Um, so it's gonna be teleport gentleman. Okay. So it means he can't grave us the gentleman, so that's really what we wanted to see happen here. Okay. He really doesn't like this. That just trades. Okay. I guess we'll block the bullseye now. Teleport. He only has one card left, and we have guard fees, so we're in really decent shape here. Here's the gentleman's ramp. Love to see it. Should I bungee right now? Should I bungee? So this just dies. Uh, I think so. Summoning... I think we want our Gargs to go face... This just dies to a banana bomb, though. Alright, let's go. Uh, should be okay here. He's only doing five. There's the Garg fate. As long as he doesn't have Grave Removal, we'll be okay. Probably should have played this though, so we can guarantee block these lanes. I guess we're always gonna block three lanes here. He's not gonna win in one. I guess with the sand. He just has a banana bomb and one more card. So here's the guard feast. Come on, give us some good things. No five drops. Let's go. Give us that good guard feast. We're getting the guard feast pretty consistently here. Surprise garg is very sad. <laughs> I just, uh, I mean, is this good? He's doing two to us. Ugh. Ba -ba 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 banana, I know. I know. The six gets blocked. Great. This <laughs> is not good. He rules that. Ugh, okay. We do not have another guard feast here. We have rocket summoning. Barrel? Barrel. We have summoning. Wonder which well asked. The egg will, will move. This is it okay. If he puts something with five attack, we just win. So he's just exploding that now. Thanks for the egg though, man. Really appreciate it. <laughs> Why is he doing that? Egg? Now what? I actually got new internet. I I, I quit version mobile. Um, this is a different one. I hope this is not going to be a constant thing. I don't know why that just happened. Time to shine for some reason? Wasting that when we have 5 health, bro. Okay. It's trying to get that damage in. Egg turns into hot dog. And, uh, we'll pl put a summoning on that. Why not? See what we get. Oh, that's nice. That's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot of damage. I mean, it's it's absorbing a lot of damage. It's just a contingency for next turn that he doesn't get something that bursts us. I don't know how that would happen. We should have this game in the bag though. He can't like I don't know what he would get. Espresso Fiat. I don't really know what that plays around. We have a Garg Feast anyway. Heck yeah. I guess like banana. It, it, well, if he has banana bomb and then walnut bowling, it would play around that theoretically. No, okay. No brainana. No brainana. No brainana. No brain. No brainana. No brain. Well, he can't. He'd have to block the one of these with the brainana anyway, so he can't. He can't get five damage. The brainana gets blocked by the gladiator. Yeah, we're fine. It's no problema. I don't like how he played this this late game here. The end game. I think we're good, guys. 
I'll add points for the gladiator. I think we got this. Well, <laughs> just infinite banana peels. <laughs> and we got um, six more points of luck for the win. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about, boys. So we're two and one with a guard feast deck. Who would have known this did? <laughs> I just feel like the moment we play against Gatling P, we're gonna like <clears throat> die. No, no, no. He can't get Doomstream from Banana Peel. That's good. Still no Zombots. So now the score is two and one. <sighs> Here we go. That's a lot of. That's a lot of damage. Uh, I think we'll keep it Bad Moon Rising in the sands with the ramp and the egg. We have answers to, uh, you know, the aggro solar flare. If not, we're just Eureka. Give me some good stuff here. Come on. Rolling Stone, Dog, and Sumo. I mean, that's three control cards, so love to see that. I like it. He's not going to play around Sumo. So, do this. Let's do it on Heights. So again, turn four. We can get a turn four Bad Moon Rising now. I'll go for Nebula, why not? Oh, what the man is going for. He rolled double threes, though. That's nice. Why not go for the Bad Moon Rising? What do we have to lose? Nothing. God damn it. <laughs> he knows, guys. He knew. He knew. <laughs> Turn four Bad Moon Rising is amazing, though. Okay. Button shrooms. Button, button. Thanks for the block meter charge, though. I really appreciate it. We'll get a good Bad Moon Rising here. Believe you me. So we don't have it this turn, and we still have one more turn here. Pretty sure. We could teleport this in. And then do Dog, Bad Moon, Rising. I like that play. We also have Bungie and Rolling Stone. We kind of haven't answered <laughs> more or less anything here. That's very sad. <laughs> Molecule, yay, fun. Granted to, god damn it. So we actually have... Ooh, we probably have to take this card out now. So it's a change in plans here. Uh... Okay, so I'm thinking of Rolling Stone, bungeeing this. We still actually could just bungee this, let the sumo die, and teleport this card in. Alright, that makes sense. So Rolling Stone, and we'll let the sumo die. To save the sumo, we'd have to use the bungee here and then teleport the dog here, but I don't think it's worth it. Teleport. Should be good. This will pop out and give us the extra two brains. He covers the environment. We don't have Bad Moon Rising anyway. So it's going to be Dog Bad Moon Rising here. Got to prevent him from getting aid if he starts playing <laughs> that much value. It's not going to be good. So he gets a 5, a 3. Very sad 5 and 3. Extremely sad. Uh, so we get Bad Moon Rising. Should I counter one of these cards or let them... I think we just let them hit us. This looks really good. Uh huh? And, uh, we can also play Final Mission, which we won't. <laughs> so he heals for less, that's nice. <laughs> These Bad Moon Risings have just been so sad. It's just a sad card because they added so many fives to the game. I mean, I'm talking about like four years ago, but still. Summoning... I think we'll save this for next turn. So now we're playing for Guard Face. Oh, 
what's going on. It's nice we have a rocket and can activate like seven damage here. Another molecule, he heals. Well, that's fun. <sighs> Teleport. Might as well. Bungie, that's nice. I'll just bungee this. Summoning. That's a cool summoning. I'll, I'll, I'll rock it here. Um, it's just a matter of... We're winning this trade anyway. It's a matter of clearing his field so he can't maul kill again. I don't know. I'm like... Yeah, Bad Moon Rising looks good. Alia. He's healing. Here we go! Here we go! Here we go! Give me a... Yeah! <laughs> now that... Now that is what I call Bad Moon Rising. Zombot, Guard Launcher, Mechasaur. Get absolutely wrecked. Absolutely dominated. We're getting free minions now, too. Hell yes. Uh, oh, damn it. I really wanted to pay, play the barrel here, but I guess we'll final mission this useless battle. Come on, man. Oh my gosh. This is going to be such a fun game because he's just going to keep doing this, too. Bruh. Um, do we even final mission? I don't think we do. I think we, we need to not... Not take this damage. La di da di da. None of his style. Yeah, he can kill the Valak with Scourge here. I'll probably Scourge. See what he gets? Weed whack. I don't even know where he'll go. He just didn't play his card. It's fine. Uh, almost at Garg Feast now. There's that. He's probably gonna use a superpower on the 0 1 this turn. Smart. Open up five more damage here. Oh my gosh. Uh-oh. 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 Oh no. <laughs> that's bad. Ladies and gentlemen, that's very bad. Guys. Oh, it's Garg Feast. Oh no, well, if you could we'll clear them, it would be. We don't have any lanes, though. <laughs> yes! 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 Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's a billion IQ. There's a billion IQ. There's a billion IQ. This is so good. This is so good. He just ramped us. The Grey Zucchini. Look at this fail. The Grey Zucchini gave us the extra brain, so now we can guard feast. I can't believe this. Come on. Come on. He gets it. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Very good. Very nice. Okay. Um, so then five and six should win. This should do it here, guys. This should do it. This will make it frenzy. Come on. Come on. He has to not roll double threes. Let's go. Five. And six. <laughs> the, great the great zucchini fail. Forever will that be known as the great, the great zucchini fail. I have never seen that before. I've never seen anything close to that before. That was crazy, guys. What a sequence. Unbelievable. I'm adding 20 points of luck for that. We're on a 30 second delay. I'm just waiting for the chat to explode. Oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> The great day for all the Jews. And that's that another fail? Oh my gosh.
That was unbelievable, that entire game, man. We have like half of a fail comp just from the stream already, because those were two very long, multifaceted, intense fails. Holy moly with that. Heck yes. David Richard. <sighs> I think this is good enough. Eureka. Get some cards that are good to teleport in. Would love to get a good Eureka. Come on. Good teleport cards. Uh, <laughs> beam me up. Uh, the, the teacher is interesting because you can teleport that in and play Bad Moon Rising. Kanga is also interesting. This has been crazy. Should I go for the fake teleportation zombie? I wonder if I should. If we're drawing out a, a, a spike weed sector with this, I'm pretty sure it's good enough too. The stream has definitely been nuts so far. Uh, we're also 3-1 for the bets now. Absolutely crazy. So we either want him to spike weed sector this, or we want him to think that it's a teleportation zombie and play Triceratops into it. So that's very sad, but it's okay. We need a bad moon rising. If he, he didn't have spike weed, so he probably does not have an environment. Safe to say. We don't really have anything to ramp into, though, yet. I don't know. Oh, come on. Actually, just got a root. I think Spike Weed he would have played. Let's go here. Where's Bad Moon Rising? I don't think we do the ramp stuff yet. Let's teleport to burn a card. We really just need finishers now. That's so sad. Running plant. Oh, the grapes with Beta, okay. Uh should be correct. Happy birthday. Cool. So we'll final something. Even face is good here. A lot of damage. In fact, really, we need the if we don't we don't see Garg Feast or Bad Moon Rising, so we really badly need these barrels. Ah, oh, it's so annoying. It's so much damage. Uh, I think we can take it out though. He's taking all well. What are we gonna end up doing about this? He'll draw two cards off of this now. Uh, I guess it's worth it. Three cards actually. <laughs> God. <laughs> He's drawing three cards from Mirna. <laughs> He's milled though. It's perfect. We'll just keep him milled now. We're gonna block. We need cards too. Oh, uh, it's actually four. <laughs> it's actually drawing four cards. Is he milled already? Yes! We did it on purpose. He can't block. I don't care. I don't care. Come on. Jeez. The man is milled. <laughs> I don't know if that was good, it probably was not. Should I play the teleportation zombie there? Probably. No! Oh my gosh, that's just perfect against this barrel. Uh, I'll final mission next turn. There's no point in doing it here. Also, your birthday, man. A lot of people have the August 11th birthday. There you are. There you are. I guess we'll go for it this turn, right? Well... We could just get a better one next turn, right? So, teleportation zombie. Into just stuff. We could, well, yeah, we'll probably teleport this in. 
Yeah, we'll set up a, a Batman Rising for next turn. Do so we have Rocket final mission here? Probably just Rocket now. So we can go Rocket Bungie. I don't really want this to, well... We can go Final Mission, Bungie Guy. We don't really want him drawing though. Final Mission. Okay, Rocket. Egg. Bungie. We're, we're pinging his block meter a lot, but it's okay. So we'll have uh, Teacher or Egg Bad Moon Rising next turn. Let's go. It's not turn 8 next turn. Is it? Oh, you're right. It is turn 8. Uh hmm. <laughs> well, hopefully he doesn't... <laughs> hopefully. The gentleman is probably the plow. What if he grave busts, though? I think this is the safest. Hopefully he doesn't uh, have a, a dragon. Hell yeah. When you see all the eggs on the field and seven brain in a brainstorm, it's clearly memes deck just freaking, you know, <laughs> a pot. I don't know, man. Hopefully he doesn't, like, kill the barrel. Well, it only kills one minion. Eh, it's fine. He actually did the shrinking, so no way. Okay. Whee. So we only have two minions left. Good shrinking violet. Maybe this will be a, um... Any rockets, so no bad moon rising, I guess. We can get it next year. <laughs> Clears our field. That's nice. Why didn't he go for the card draw? What's in the box? You're garbage. <laughs> oh, no. Do we final mission that to face? Hell yeah, let's go. We're going face. Now we just need six damage. It's called Rocket Goats. So here's a Batman Rising. So again, if we're spending four... What's safer, a 2-3 or a... or a Teacher? If we're spending four, so we'll be down to five, we'll be back up to seven, let's cost six. We can't play all three of these. Um, I'm pretty sure right now, just spreading these cheeks and playing, I don't know, Shrinking Violet's still a thing, but we'll go for this. Whoa, they rid of that comp, okay, too bad, I did exactly 12 damage for the win. Too bad, alright. So we're 3 and 2 now. Never lucky. Also take off 10 points of unlock. Oh, we had that guy. He just cleared our field so badly there. The Shrinking Violet really got us. When you set a Bad Moon Rising and you're letting seven brains hang without really another contingency, I mean, if he has field clear, it's really rough. Um, <laughs> I'll keep this. Too bad. Let's see what happens here. I'd love to get an answer to the two two. I want that egg back. We could just frosty here. 
Gargolith is a very strong card against Solar Flare. I think it's just Frosty into the into the card draw. Oh my gosh, jeez. What do we get? Garbage. Do we want to prevent growth or prevent? I think this is good enough. It's gonna be milled as hell right now. I'm pretty sure it's Egg Valley Zombie. So aggro with some tempo. Really hope this has two attack. That's all we want to see here. Great, perfect. We're, we're, we're okay with the teleportation zombie and all the teleports. We should be able to stabilize. We have four bungees in this deck somewhere, but imagine getting those against the one guy who's running aggro. So with the teleport in our hand, we can pass if he kills us. No big deal. No biggity. Look at the aggression, though. Be nice to have a nebula of it. Uh, probably don't want to give him cards, right? <sighs> we could just rocket here. Rocket, I guess, will be more useful against a um summoning. Rocket will be more useful. That's okay. Against like a, a strike through minion. This we can prevent the damage anyway. He'll get cards, but we really just have to. Uh, Stabilize the tempo here, we should be good. Just egg. Egg and probably teleport barrel. Can also rock it. See what we get here. Toxic Waste Imp is very cool. Um, so we'll take five damage instead of eight with the barrel. This is good. I don't know why he's well, yeah, okay. This is why we didn't show him the barrel. He didn't know this was gonna die anyway. Uh this is pretty darn good. We gotta try to set up a, a win condition now. We have to play around this um, see the Astrocado pit. Kinda harsh. We don't really have a bungee, I really <laughs> as many bungees as we can get here. We can't really set any of these up, so I'm gonna go for a teleport and see if we can get something to counter that pit. I'd love to be able to do that and set up the nebula here. So we can actually do something instead of playing defense. Yeah. So getting a getting a one or a two would be amazing here. It's a two, but not good enough. Just surviving. <laughs> Yeah, eight health. This teleportation zombie being teleported in here is good. It's another rocket. We'll have to see it. So we can just pass. I, I wish we had smaller cards. We could develop the nebula and actually get something going here. Our curve is too high. These are our conjures. From Haunted Pumpkin and some from Eureka. They're just too expensive. Frosty mustache. If we can set up the nebula, it means we can de develop this, we can do stuff. And... Okay. Elderberry. We still can't kill the pit. We don't have a teleport to burn. Huh. 
I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just he's just gonna keep on getting astrocados now. So sad. Maybe I should have killed the pit instead. There's nothing we can do here. This is so sad. Set this up with Nebula and hope for a miracle. I don't even know. This curve sucks. <laughs> so we have eight. We have nothing to do on turn eight here. He needs three damage to win. Ah, we're just gonna lose this one. I have to just accept that. It'd be so nice if you could set these up the same turn as you play the excavator. It's just an issue. Hopefully that's all he does. What else is in his hand though? He's got three cards. Gotta have something playable here. Interesting. So we're taking a lethal amount of damage unless we miracle block here. Yeah, I don't do it. Alright. <laughs> For three and three. That was sad. It's really just getting the conjures that cost too much. We really could have stabilized. And I, did we get a bungee plumber that game? I don't think we did. It's very sad. We have summoning, we have backup dancer. We have so many things that will help us deal with a deck like that. We just didn't get them, man. Too bad. Barrel? Did we get a barrel? I don't think we did, right? Oh, we got one. Yeah, we teleported in. <sighs> I'll keep a rocket. Oh, that should be okay. Pretty sure we just barrel that next turn. Cardboard. Go for this. I hope this doesn't get hit though. He's got two shots. Ugh. Okay, we're good. As long as we kill the Punisher. Stabilize a little bit here. Cards, let's see it. the egg. Bro! Oh my gosh. That's a lot of damage. So, three plus three. Uh, barrel. Do I want to play this here? I think so. We always get the final mission. He can't have grave removal. Okay. No pine clone. No, 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 no. Okay. I mean, it gets like a one, a two. I think it's another buff true. Nothing dies to the barrel splash, though, so that's nice. Come on, man. Oh, whatever. Ugh. I guess keeping Gentleman Zombie alive is the priority here. Very sad final mission. We're doing okay, we have the card advantage. I'm guessing we have more late game in our hand than he does. Uh, so I think we're looking for a one drop now. An egg would be nice! Hell yeah! We gotta play defensively, we're at six health. 
He's <laughs> just so much damage to us. Come on, Captain. Uh, if he kills the 2-1, at least we have a rocket as a contingency plan. We really do need to Bad Moon Rising this turn, though, to have a shot. So, yeah. <sighs> Cosmic Phase. Astro, oh my gosh. Glad he... Ah, that's so bad. <laughs> really bad play by him. Um, I feel like the Cosmic should have gone here, because whatever it conjures, you kind of want to go in lane one, right? Uh, we're definitely going to Bad Moon Rising. Let's see what we got. Give us something good. A uh, little bit of gadget. Oh, so we got frenzies happening here. So we definitely... Yeah, we don't want to move these two. I'm just going to move this one. We'll prevent the two damage from coming in. Like, it's shot. And then, that really surprisingly good smashing guard here, because the frenzies, not only does it kill the Astro Shroom, but it puts all this damage on him. Really, really nice. Love to see it. And gadget. Oh, it didn't really do anything. <laughs> so, we got options. Against Captain Combustible, you're never safe. Who knows what he's got. Hopefully not a repeat loss. Oh my gosh. It's a burb. Why is he not going after the 5-2 is the real question. I kind of want to win this game. Oh, the misery. Oh. Um, Lou a Meteor. This does win. So we'll go for this. 1 and 3 has to get Meteor to survive. All of his other powers are buffs. Oh. Oh, get wrecked. Ha! Add four points of luck for him not getting Meteor. I don't know. Uh, so for the bets, we're four and three now. Uh, so this essentially, this is game eight. This will be the last game of the stream. We're in essentially in a seven and two scenario here. <laughs> After an insane, the, 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 I don't know how the luck is. The unlock is only forty-seven, and the lad, it seems like this stream had a lot more going on. But this will be the last game for all the beans. We'll either break even at four and four, or we'll get the five and three, which means you could hit ultimate league with this deck. <laughs> know what I'm saying? This game will determine it. A little bit of oh, against another Captain Combustible. I don't. I don't feel like it. I'm gonna have to get rid of this because we don't have enough early game. This hand sucks. Hopefully, we'll get something from either Backup Dancer, Summoning Eureka, or or, be, <laughs> or Telepathy. Everything usually gives you little cards. I'm gonna do this. Um, def it's it is defensively. Because we want to have the option of a final mission next turn, just in case he, he puts some BS on the field. Here's Bungie. It just makes this hand able to survive a lot better. Pass. There's Bad Moon Rising. Just gotta get some little guys now. Little dudes. That's a huge play. A tremendous play. Oh, that's trouble, man. What does he do? Why did he play this puff shroom? Is he high? I'm gonna kill the Lily now just to play around team ups. Why did he play puff shroom there? Now he's not doing enough damage. Maybe he's going for Pine Claw, I don't really get it. You build me up, you break me down, believe it. I think I'm gonna save this. I think it's gonna be Nebula Egg. For real. What is he doing? I hope he doesn't have Buff Shroom, that would sting, oh my gosh. So now, uh, we just have to... For oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, I think I have to Rocket. Changing plans. Yup. I should have played Egg, huh? 
Block the eight, please. Okay. We needed backup dancers there. I guess this is okay. Uh, we're getting so low. Such low. So summoning this and final mission, I guess. Oh, come on, man. That's so stupid, bro. We just lose on the spot because of that. These cats are combustible. I mean, it's a, the aggressive guys are going to kill this deck. We don't have that good of control. Too bad, it's guaranteed. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> I'm going to play one more game. The answer is no already, but I want to play one more game with this deck. I don't want to end on that. just got right what is with the captains no I'm not playing against captain three games in a row mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <sighs> okay here we go here's the last game the answer is no on the easy bet <laughs> Wait, was it still on the delay? Oh, my bad. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay. Too bad. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're in it, guys. They actually have the theoretical answer to Triceratops. I like the backup dancers for the Batman Rising, so we're not going to spend them. Here. Mm. We're not even close to this. Rough. I'm going to have to just burn a card here. What's that? So we have four, five. I think this is fine. I think we're going to teleport both of these in, and then next turn we'll have a Bad Moon Rising. Come on, man, what? A... <laughs> I don't really know what I'm supposed to do here. Okay. Do we final mission one of these? We need it for the Bad Moon Rising more. We do play this. See what happens here. Well, <laughs> it'd be great if us every single gravestone. I don't know how we're gonna win. Okay. So what is the play now? That was turn five. We aren't even close. We're not even close. I don't know how we're gonna win this. We can play all this next turn anyway, so I might as well hold on to it. Ugh. 
We're getting wrecked. Look at this hand. So bad. So we spam back up here. If one of the backups end up here, then we final mission into the T3. For fudge's sake. It almost looks like he know why was he playing this weenie beanie here? It almost looks like he knows what we're doing, but so, so. Icicle, thanks for the raid. Okay. Uh, this looks pretty good. Control using the landscaper set up a pretty big card in lane five. He's moving in. Bam. K. I don't understand. I don't get that at all. Uh, okay. So it just feeds. I mean, he wants his admiral to live for some reason. We. So we could bad moon rising. We can also double nebula. We can get poor damage from this. Probably just bad moon rising here. We get Nebula, Nebula, final mission. It probably is better. Oh my gosh, for real. So that that was the thing with the spike weed sector. So we just lose. Where do you get Colonel Cordon from? Okay. Well, in case we block, that's the play. Okay, I'll take it. Guys, we need a miracle. We, oh, 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 okay, okay. Uh, two beans would win. In final mission. I don't know what else we're doing. Final mission actually kills the 6-6 six, six here, so we can final mission Bad Moon Rising. In fact, we can final mission Garg Feast. If he wouldn't play Dragon, final mission would have gotten us to 11 there. Come on, man. So we just lose. We can't go face. Now we're done. Bro, wait, if this dies, oh, we can actually teleport something in and still live here. Yep, it's still doable. Still doable. We need to top deck a, a guy though. We need to top deck something to just block this. Yes. Okay, we're in the game. Guys, we're in the game, we're in the game, we're in the game. <laughs> We're in the game. If we win this game, man. If we win this. <laughs> so now, we're gonna have Bad Moon, right? Well, well, we can have Garg Feast. Please, no more Grave Busters. We have Garg Feast just like this. Or we have Bad Moon Rising when we play this one. This is probably safer in case he grave bust lane one, right? Okay, let's go. I like the bad moon rising. This would be insane if we won this game. If we win this game, this is crazy. Rocket, oh no. Wait, so... We're gonna have nine, and this only costs three? Wait a second. So if we play this, we go down to... Down to... We go down to five. But then we go back up to seven, so this is playable. Down to five, up to seven. Hell yeah! All right, we we'll take it. So procs the block. Nothing. He doesn't have any removal cards in the superpower because it's Beta Caratina. There's nothing that's gonna mess this up. Absolutely nothing. We're fine. Glad we went for the Bad Moon Rising here. That's okay. He can move a card. Now here's the Bad Moon Rising. Come on, come on, come on. The grand finale. 
Well, we have guard face. That's the good news. <laughs> We're just gonna get block busted now. <laughs> Come on, make some crazy digger. Garbage. Okay, okay, we have redemption. It's redemption time. Redemption time. Redemption time. No dragon. That's fine. <laughs> oh, he knows. No, 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 no blockbuster. No, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Yep, it's bad when rising. It's bad when rising. I don't care. And we'll have guard feast for next turn. This is perfect. Ah. Okay, come on. Take two, guys. As I was saying. As I was saying. Let's go. The Okay. Hey, we still have Garg Feast though. Is Garg Feast still good? I mean, it'll, we'll get a, a deep sea Garg that draws a card. I, don't, I don't think we wait Garg Feast till next turn, yeah. Garg Feast gotta be next turn still. So. Alright, let's go. This is good enough. Yay! Hopefully he doesn't top deck a dragon. Oh my gosh, we're gonna draw so many cards from these guards. <laughs> uh, this is six bullseye, and it also draws two more cards here. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's rampy rampy time. Hell yeah. A little card to be able to kill something would be really nice for down to two health. I don't feel safe. Wow, we can't even. Well, this costs two. No, we can't even. We have to just guard feast. Okay. Well, <laughs> if he has a. Dragon or something, we just lose. This is not a gimme anymore, because we have to block lane one. Guys, we need Zombot. In Zombot, we trust. No! That's <laughs> guaranteed lethal, even if we block. <laughs> what? Bro, Shamrocket, Shamrocket, Brain Nana. Alright guys, this deck is 4 and 5. You clearly cannot hit Ultimate League with this deck. We're gonna end on the losing win rate. That's a satisfying loss though. This will go on YouTube despite the score. Oh sorry, just... <laughs> the final score, just because of that game, is 69 luck and 99 unluck. Come on, man. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed. I certainly did. Yes, it's going on YouTube. I don't care. What an amazing stream. This was a lot of fun. Hope Peace. This is right.